I understand that, that uh, two weeks ago you got into a bike mm -hmm. accident. Mm -hmm. You flew over the handles. Yeah, that's, okay. that's right. And how did you land? You said something about how did you land? Oh, like this uh, way or? It was for this way and then uh -huh. I put my hand on the, on the, on the road. So, uh -huh. You know, this is something I feel like that. I can stand for a little bit and then um, I try to move it. I say, okay, I think it's not, not broken. So. I was keeping the the pain for a for a long. Let's check the this one first. So yeah. the, you okay. could go like this fully? Yeah. No problem? No. What can you do with this one? Yeah, I can flex more than that. So you can't flex all the no, way? No. And what about extend all the way? Can you do that? No. Also no. So we see over here, yeah. the patient over here has basically uh, lost about twenty degrees. Mm -hmm. Can't flex all the way. So if I go yeah. extend all the way yeah. Okay. Yeah, I feel the pain, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's a thing. Once again, so go like that. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, that's painful, yeah. right? So yeah. we can't it's extend all the way. No. All right. No. So can we go like this? No. Uh, uh, oh, not too yeah, bad. No, not too okay. bad. Yeah, but I can. All right, that's not too okay. bad. Yeah. Now what about the shoulder soft? Can you like uh, raise up? Yeah. Oh, okay. We got something. Okay, yeah. so raise it up. What, what do you have trouble doing there? Yeah. Can't raise all the way? No. Okay. Like this. All right, so no, basically, no. already what I'm thinking is that because the way you fell over, mm -hmm. you landed on your mm -hmm. hand, mm -hmm. you know, that's what we call foosh, right? Yeah. So mm -hmm. fall out, outstretched hand. Mm -hmm. There's a chain reaction in terms of the force. Mm -hmm. So it's going to pack over, start from here, mm -hmm. then to the elbow, mm -hmm. and then into here as well. All right? All right. Now, all this, why you didn't exactly absorb the impact as well as it should. Mm -hmm. And we're all going to find out a lot more in depth on these, these structural tests and examination. Mm -hmm. You may have a potential problem here, mm -hmm. right at the bits yeah. of neck, because the yeah, nerve maybe, yeah. goes from the neck, goes mm -hmm. to the shoulder, the elbow, and to the wrist. So if that's mm -hmm. compromised, mm -hmm. you can't absorb the impact as well as it should. Mm -hmm. That's why, mm -hmm. even though you felt on both yeah. hands, yeah, right hands yeah. the left one is the one. Mm -hmm. You know, it took more it's, than yeah, more in the more than the, than the, the, the right. right, yeah, yeah, yeah. because I raise you know the break yeah. right there and then fell over. Well, we'll we'll take a closer look, see, okay, because uh, if that is the case, mm -hmm. it might be the right side of that nerve may be mm -hmm. healthy and fine, mm -hmm. whereas the left side mm -hmm. that may be pinched off and compromised. That's yeah. why this thing went out the way it did. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, but we're gonna do a test to really confirm that. Okay, perfect. Now, let's perfect. See. I don't know if the viewers can see this pretty well. There's already a pitting edema right there. Mm -hmm. You just like see there's a hump over here and it just sinks in another hump over here. So I'm not surprised if there's a heat meeting there. Mm -hmm. And there is right at that spot, mm -hmm. right at that pitting edema. So we got one right there. See, we have another similar story as well. So, because I see a, there's quite a bit of swelling over here. Mm -hmm. Not a tremendous amount, but still. See, that's what allows us to show that little heat reading over here as well. Mm -hmm. Now, let's check, see what's going on in the neck. See, we've got something on the left hand side there. You know, see, right there. So we're reading over here as well. No problems? Mm, no. What about this fellow over here? Yeah, a little bit. You're flinching already. <laughs> Can't even tolerate this fella. Yeah, that fellow's in trouble. Right there. Yep. That's not moving too well out as well either. Sit back. Yeah, right off the bat, this is all this muscle swelling going on. Yeah, right here, all on the left hand side right there. All the swell on the left hand side, that's what actually that's what started pitching off the nerve, just what we uh, hypothesized before.
See, you can't even turn your head to the love tool either. Mm -hmm. Tender right there? Right at that spot? Pain? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. That's six cervicals in trouble. All right. Here's a story. We identified there are some key areas that we need to address. Mm -hmm. So in your case, you're complaining about the whole time. I've got a lot of pain in my wrist, mm -hmm. elbow, and my shoulder. Mm -hmm. right? So the sixth cervical, that's what we identified and found out. Mm -hmm. It controls the shoulder, mm -hmm. the elbow, mm -hmm. and that wrist. Mm -hmm. There's a good little domino effect, just like this. Mm -hmm. Now, even though you originally come in here for those kinds of problems, yeah. why are we addressing the other two? Mm -hmm. Now, the reason is this, that fifth lumbar right, mm -hmm. that provides structural support for, all, for everything above it. Mm -hmm. And on top of that, what we also see is for the sixth dorsal over here that also provides structural biomechanical support for mm -hmm. your neck. Mm -hmm. This also has some biomechanical influences for your shoulder blade as well. Mm -hmm. So we're going to see it you know, after we correct this, see mm -hmm. how it does for your shoulders. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So just as we, sh as we discussed before in the nerve chart, mm -hmm. the, these discs over here, they're kind of small. It's just not fun. We test confirm that fifth lumbar, that's in trouble. And as a result, that's where we start to see your whole entire structure. Everything mm -hmm. is above it. Mm -hmm. You lean over to the right, Mm -hmm. And then to the left, and even more to the left. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The sixth dorsal over here, that's what we also need to address. Mm -hmm. Sixth cervical, okay, also we need to address. Mm -hmm. And what I also see is a little trouble right at this AC joint over here. See over here, the gap yeah. over there? Yeah. That's normal. Mm -hmm. But this one, this AC joint over here is a little bit elevated, mm -hmm. just slightly. Mm -hmm. About one millimeter or so, but we have a gap over here. Yeah. At the top of the scapula on this one, it rotated a bit higher as well. Mm -hmm. So we're going to address, clear all the blockages to your nerve system first. Mm -hmm. Get the nerves restored for the shoulder blade, the kind of humeral joint, mm -hmm. and then to the elbow and to the wrist. And here's the other thing that I'm seeing over here. Mm -hmm. The way this ulnar here, okay, that's why you have a little trouble extending all the way. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's jammed in place. So we got to we had to clear that up and realign that elbow, mm -hmm. and then for your wrist over here, mm -hmm. this should be in proper alignment, mm -hmm. right? But the way you impacted the femoral bolt yeah. you knocked the lunate out. Mm -hmm. This middle bone over here mm -hmm. is supposed to fall along just like a rainbow shape. Mm -hmm. It breaks it. So this rainbow's over here, the arch, mm -hmm. no, this one, it went this way. So I need to correct that one. Mm -hmm. The right one is doing the exact same problem. It yeah. should be a nice curvature over here. Mm -hmm. But nope, this one also, it went that way. Oh. So now we need to fix as well. Mm -hmm. Let's get it rolling. Wow, too many bones and then the broken. <laughs> I, I, I felt this, I think it was a little, a little too fixing in this area that's mm -hmm. it so that's why it's about you know you know as you know come with the specialist you know mm -hmm. all those things so i'm well, happy to to be with you well thank you yeah. but the main thing is this even though you said fractured no no none yeah. of this is fractured so mm -hmm. that's good news oh okay right? because i don't see yeah. any evidence of fracture in your x-ray right. so let's go ahead let's work on cleaning those nerve interference get them oh. out of the way okay yeah. come on up Good. Here we go. Oh, right there. There we go. Left shoulder. Start shoulder. There's the magic. All right, hands back. See, this is already jammed up a bit. Let's get this working. There we go. Good. Yeah, it's also jammed.
There it goes. The red one's actually not bad at all. Mm -hmm. Yeah, see? Yeah. AC's out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Pump that up before we set it. And all that clicking in there? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's why this is misaligned. I'm going to pop that back in. Mm -hmm. Let it go. There it is. Mm -hmm. There you go. Yeah, you got tumors going on too. Yeah. That's what I said. Oh, oh I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. I didn't know it was not so fun. Mm. There we go. That was a beauty. Mm. Come on up. Okay. Go ahead. Raise that right shoulder. See what you like. Okay. Raise the left one. Yeah, much better. It's rich. I can raise more. You can raise it more? Yeah. How much more would you say? Hey, well, much more, a lot much of more, more, a lot more, yeah. All right, I yeah. like the sound of that. Yeah. All right, next start. Mm -hmm. Let's check your elbows. Yeah. Yeah, that's not bad. Relax that. Just relax. Yeah. Who needs jammed? Oh, there's a piece. Mm -hmm. Good. Mm -hmm. Feel the pain, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. See, mm -hmm. so this is where we are. Mm -hmm. We're at the ulnar and humerus right there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's not so fun, right? So we're gonna pump this fluid yeah. out of the way first before we set this. Okay. So just to show your viewers over here. Mm -hmm. So this is your right shoulder. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is the right, this is the right shoulder model. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna flip it around, but I don't have a left model, but you get the, mm -hmm. you get the idea. Mm -hmm. So the problem is right now, that's where, where we're testing it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right over here, mm -hmm. it's right over here. Mm -hmm. so, so over here, you know, mm -hmm. we just can't pump the fluid in the way. Mm -hmm. So we're going to pump that all out of the way before we set this back mm -hmm. in its proper place. Mm -hmm. Okay. So that's what we're doing right over here. Mm -hmm. So we're going to pump that in before we set it. Okay. All right, G. So we're gonna pump a lot more. There we go. Just breathe. Just breathe. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I know it's intense. That's why we need to pump it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry about that, Chan. Right. Give it a try. Oh. Okay. Yeah, try, try a little bit. Try to see extended. See how you like it. Mm -hmm. How is it? I just feel pain. I get to see the pain. Pain. I say you still feel the pain because uh -huh. again, there's still part of that swelling in it. Mm -hmm. But how is the extension? How's the mobility? Yeah, it's more. Uh, yeah, I can. I can. I can extend it more. Yeah. Try again. So it's not all the way. Mm -hmm. So we still have about, we improved about 50%. Yeah. We still have 10 degrees range of motion left. That's still fixed. Mm -hmm. So here's what I want you to do. Mm -hmm. I want you to ice this over here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, 20 minutes, three times a day. Okay. But we also have a little, uh, gotcha. Yeah. I think you knocked this out too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I feel it? pain over there. Yeah. A little bit. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's not too bad in this one, the radio head. I'm just gonna pump that up a little bit in there too. Mm -hmm. There it goes. See, because over here you couldn't rotate. 
Mm-hmm. We could have wrote you know, super and pro nature mm-hmm. the rest of it, but now it's all to come into being. Mm-hmm. There it goes. We're not going to do a full set on this one. Mm-hmm. You need to pop it up, you know what I'm saying? Now you could do this. Try that. Yeah. All right? Good. Now let's work on this lunate over here. Mm-hmm. Oh, belly. Check that out, champ. You feel that? <laughs> so no, I, I don't feel too much. <laughs> it's, this is all gritty. Yeah. Here. Dang, you really knocked the living heck out of this one. See, that's that lumen we're trying to pump in there. Mm-hmm. Yeah. There it goes. Mm-hmm. Get a little more out of there. Okay. Mm-hmm. There it goes. Mm-hmm. There it is. Wow. There we go. Mm-hmm. Now I'll walk around and see if I like it. Well, now. Okay. Yeah. Now it's, I can move more. More <laughs> easy. No, it's still pain here. Well, no big surprise. That's mm-hmm. why I want you to ice. Yeah. You gotta ice this fellow down. Mm-hmm. Right? I want you to ice it down 20 minutes, three times a day. Okay. You gotta get that swell out of the way. Whatever you do, don't use heat. Okay. I'm always gonna swell this up, make it worse. Oh, okay. How's it now? Yeah. Okay. Hey, how do you like yeah. that? Let's, uh, let's test a little more. Mm-hmm. Hey, that's doing better already. Mm-hmm. Good. So you're about five degrees range of motion left that mm-hmm. we need to address. Mm-hmm. So I figure once you ice this down, mm-hmm. okay, you're probably going to get that other remaining 5%. Okay. Get that out of the way. Okay. Perfect. All right, Chip. Yeah. Yeah. Just be careful yeah. with that bicycle. Yeah, man. Huh? <laughs> that's what, that's what everyone saying to me. Yeah, you're not supposed to be flying over that, you know, over that bike, you know. Yeah, yeah, but okay. Now, now I'm feeling, you know, the pain is gone, mm-hmm. so I can, I can move it. Good. Here's yeah. another tip for the viewers as well. Yeah. You know, some people may consider, oh, can I put a brace on here because mm-hmm. it's painful trying to mobilize mm-hmm. it. Mm-hmm. Well, in this case, because we realigned it, I mm-hmm. don't recommend bracing. Mm-hmm. Right? It's no different from, you know, we seen as, you know, other people when we were kids. Mm-hmm. What happens when you break one forearm and you yes. put a cast on it? Mm-hmm. Yeah. After a couple of months, when you take the cast off, what happens? Yeah. It's not the same size, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. One is skinnier than the other. Yeah. So when we immobilize this thing, mm-hmm. right, it's going to cause the muscles and the ligaments to atrophy. Mm-hmm. That that's why I was scared. That, that all, right. uh, one one reason that that also to go to don't go to hospital. You know, that's uh, you say you know well, why not try Actually, to, you know, yes and no. If it was fractured, then definitely you have to go oh, to the yeah, hospital. Yeah, yeah. We definitely yeah. refer you to orthopedic surgeon, yeah, 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 yeah. which we have done for time and time. Mm-hmm. But the X-ray shows there's no fracture evident whatsoever in this elbow or the wrist mm-hmm. either mm-hmm. for both of them. Mm-hmm. So you're in the clear for this one. Mm-hmm. It's, just, it's just that you just happen to experience a pretty nasty sprain, strain, mm-hmm. injury in your elbow and your wrist themselves. Mm-hmm. Compounded with the fact that the nerve was pinched on the left side. Mm-hmm. So yeah. that's why we had to actually address this first. Mm-hmm. That's why on the right side, mm-hmm. it's actually functional. That's mm-hmm. why you don't have too much of an impact damage yeah. on your right, uh, your yeah. right arm, mm-hmm. the elbow and the wrist itself. Mm-hmm. But this one, it took more to run because it just didn't have enough nerve function there. Mm-hmm. So that's why it's oh, key. Yeah. The pain gone, so I can move it. Yeah. That's great. Wow. That's right. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. The the pain's gone. <laughs> so All right, it's it was painful, but you know, now it's it's gone. Nice. I can move it. I can move it. Oh. That's why I'm looking for the yoga doctor. <laughs> Oh, well, you came to thank my you. place. Thank oh, you, man. No, no, yeah, thank you. It was when I saw it in the, in the video, you know, I said, oh, I will, I, will, I will go there. I will go there. That's what makes an appointment. Thank you. Oh, thank you're you very welcome. Much. Thank you. Yeah, I feel better now. Feel okay, better. my friend. Yeah. We'll see you next time. Good. Yeah. Thank you. Thank Tomorrow. you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. How's everything so far? So far, it's good. Very good, actually. You know, the, just the pain in, the, in, the, in this area. Mm-hmm. I feel like my arm is so it feels like too tired, so mm-hmm. I can push more than that. So mm-hmm. you know, when I carry some uh, some things, I can carry like more than, uh, than twenty pounds at least. You know, it's it's very it's right. painful in this area. You know, this so. part. Of, I feel the pain in this part also, mm-hmm. uh, and in this area, I I feel like it's 
spend this. Just want to be clear. So mm -hmm. whenever you carry heavy items such as 20 pounds or more, it causes a lot of pain over there. Yeah, I, I think so. Yeah, yeah, or, yeah. I guess. Mm -hmm. Yeah. How are things like uh, you know lifting overhead? No, that's good. That's good. Actually, it's good. Yeah, you know. I, so that's I, perfectly I, fine now. Yeah, I find I find that just in this in this area like the So thing. that's the only thing left. The only thing. Yeah, yeah. All the right. only thing that the rest is perfect. All right. Yeah. Hey, that's great to hear. Yeah. All right. Let's go ahead and see yeah. the work. It's also very small to read here. Hey, look at that. It's moving. Mm -hmm. That's good. Same start with this one. Also moving. Yeah. Very good. Yeah. Test this one here. So there are very slight little fixation, swelling, and muscle spasms right here in that sixth cervical here. Just very slight. Let's pump that fellow up. There it goes. Okay, now it's free full range of motion right there. So based on what the findings that we found so far, mm -hmm. you don't have any abnormal heat temperatures. Mm -hmm. There's a very slight one, just mm -hmm. not even half a point on this mm -hmm. over six circle over here. Mm -hmm. No swelling, no muscle spasms, only here. Yeah. Very slight, we pumped it up and mm -hmm. now it's that's fine as well. Mm -hmm. So based on those indicators, that's why, mm -hmm. that tells us your body is actually healing. We're not gonna correct that at all. Okay, uh -huh. so we're not gonna touch that. Uh -huh. Now let's go ahead, let's take a look at what's going on at your elbows. Yeah. Okay. Turn it right there, huh? Mm -hmm. yeah. So you got the puffiness all around here, mm -hmm. swollen right there. Let's check the radio head now. Okay, so radius is also mm -hmm. in trouble too. Mm -hmm. See, so every time I supinate and pronate mm -hmm. that radius, mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, you're flinching right there. So mm -hmm. it tells us this is also in trouble too. Mm -hmm. All right, so I'm gonna set both radius and the ulnar today. Just get all that, pump all that fluid out of the way first. Simple. First things first, I set the radius right now. Pump it up. There we go. Okay, so radius is not too bad. This one. Pump some more fluid out of the way before we set this. Mm. Okay, there we go. So I have a little more give. Mm -hmm. There we go. Now it's got full range of motion right there. There it is. Let's relax. We're gonna, we're gonna hold this place a little bit more longer <laughs> so your body can recognize what is normal amount is supposed to be. Mm -hmm. Alright, there we go. Now I'm just gonna oh. pump some more fluid out of the way. There we go. There we go. Oh. Yeah, I know it's not fun there. Mm -hmm. You did a number to this elbow over here. You know, all that fluid coming out of the way there. There we go. All right, 
Now I'll give that a try. Ah. <laughs> ah. Wow. Give that a try. So I've been there for. Mm -hmm. What's different about that fella? Yeah, it's not the moment <laughs> it feels pain. Mm -hmm. So by the second we did quite a bit of work. Yeah. Like how's your range of motion? Yeah. yeah. It's yeah. It, I feel I feel much I can You could bend more? Yeah, more. Okay. Mm -hmm. What about extending? Mm, it's, it's feeling something in here. Well, that's where all that fluid is, yeah. so it's jamming in. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so. Yes. All right. Uh -huh. So here's I think something in this. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Right, that's yeah. the same spot too. Don't yeah. for this ulna yeah. over here. It's quite small. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's because we set this bone mm -hmm. right, into its place. Okay. So don't be surprised when you have a swan because it's yeah. over here. You have mm -hmm. a little swollen pad. Mm -hmm. That's what this is over here. Mm -hmm. okay. Over here, this is what the viewers can see over here. Mm -hmm. See the puffiness; it has drained out quite a bit. Mm -hmm. Right, so so I can't tap it as much. But this one, see this one over here. Mm -hmm. Right, you still have some fluid in here. Mm -hmm. So here's what you do: I want you to put an ice pack over here. Okay. Calm it down. Twenty mm -hmm. minutes, three mm -hmm. times a day. Mm -hmm. You gotta pump all that fluid out of okay. it, and you'll get more range of motion out of that. Oh. Okay. All right. Yeah. So okay. I feel a pain over here also. Okay, let's take a look. You can relax yourself. There's a piece. Yeah, hold up. Mm -hmm. There it goes. Just relax, just relax. Now I'll try it. Yeah, yeah, that's better, yeah. Well, this is not too much pain, but you know, this is a, this arms bother me a lot. I hear you. Well, do me a favor, also yeah. try not to lift anything heavy on that elbow. Okay. Right? This right. thing does need some time to heal up. Mm -hmm. right? Let's yeah. see you the next visit. Okay, perfect. All right, you got it. Thank Jack. you very much. Have thank you. Good. Thank you, thank you. Give us the latest updates. How are yeah. you doing? Yeah, it's, it's feeling good now, you know. It's, much better than before, yeah. The pain was, as I said, the pain is feeling this side now. Show to the viewers the yeah. uh, And this side oh. now, so. So how is this area? This area is, no, it's not pain now. So I so can I can carry some heavy stuffs now. So yeah, this good. area is, is feeling pain, you know. Okay, what's, so, what so, do you have trouble doing with this one? Uh, for example, you can do this mm -hmm. too much, so I can pull more than that. Because, mm -hmm. for example, this can be when I'm sleeping or something, it's slow. Mm. Sleep my arm also, and then feel pain. This this part. Got it. What about mm. carrying heavy stuff? No, this is no much much better now. I much can better. I can carry yeah. I can carry okay. heavy things. Yeah. That's great. Yeah. 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 All right. Let's this, take a look. See what's mm -hmm. going on. Yeah. yeah. Small little reading there. Same deal with this one, also. Very, very small reading. It's a little blip, one point. That's pretty good. Yeah. It's not too bad. I'm just gonna pop the arrows. Mm -hmm. It just went good. You just need a little touch up. Mm -hmm. So if 
five. Cross your hands. Well, that's fine too. Mm -hmm. Let's check your shoulders. There it goes. AC slightly not. Yeah, there it goes. Good. Let's check this one. No, it's not bad at all. Okay, now let's check your elbow. Stand up, please. Right here, huh? Yeah. Okay, see, it's still mm -hmm. swollen right there. Mm -hmm. Let's check this out now. Nothing there, huh? No. See, this is good. See, yeah. what I, this is what I'm trying to feel over here. Your radial head is mm -hmm. over here. Mm -hmm. Usually, the swelling over here, just like what we did, uh, you know, your first mm -hmm. visit. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't feel it there anymore. So yeah. this is great. Yeah. But you still have mm -hmm. swelling right here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's out. Uh -uh. There you go. Mm -hmm. You gotta set this poor fellow. Get a little more torque. Just get a. Uh, there it is. <laughs> Good. I'll give it a whirl. <laughs> How's that feeling now? Yeah. Okay, yeah, turn it like this way. See how it feels. Yeah. Yes, it feels much better, yeah. All right, champ. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, I, I feel a pain in this area. I don't know why it's so... I can, for example, I can push like a heavy uh -huh. on this. I feel... All right, let's take a look. Just yeah. relax. Mm -hmm. Relax this over here. There it is. Wow. That was itching to go. I got a little more of this one. Just relax. There's mm -hmm. that fella. No, right, just relax. Relax your elbow. Yeah. Here it goes. Here's your parts for. Now I give it a try. Yeah, yeah. Let's see. What it is. Yeah. All right, chef. Yeah. Thank you very much. Oh, you're very thank, welcome. Thank you. Thank right. you. We'll thank see you. you next video. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you. My arm is now working perfectly. So I have no, I have no pain. I have nothing. So this is. This is amazing how I feel it. I can move it. So uh -huh. there's no pain a lot. No problems rotating no around. No problem, nothing. I can turn around. This what about carrying heavy stuff? Yeah, that's great. That's also, I can carry it or heavy things also, yeah. So hey. yeah, that's great. That's great. That's I'm great. glad to yeah. hear. Yeah, that's great. So that's why, that's why today I come to say thank you very much. My, my arms totally working perfectly now. So I can turn it, there's no pain, nothing else. I don't feel it, nothing else. Oh, you're yeah. very welcome. Yeah, no, thank, thank you, you, thank you, you, doctor. Thank you, thank you. You're thank you. It's a, it's especially, you know, as I saw, I saw in the video, I said, oh, well, I'm going to go there. So it's for some, something to do with this. I feel, I feel that farm, so it was painful for them. It's, it's feeling good. <laughs> yeah, thank yeah, you. it's amazing. It's amazing. Thank you very much. Thank oh, you're you. very thank welcome. You. Thank you. Thanks for your Yeah, yeah.